So yet another surprising announcement here. Seem to have uh, one every uh, week or so now with an old franchise coming back in an interesting and unexpected way. Uh, this one is exciting in general, but personally slightly disappointing. Onimusha Warlords, the uh, game from 2001 on the PS2, which was later brought with some enhancements to the original Xbox, is coming to Steam, the Xbox One, PS4, and Nintendo Switch at the beginning of next year with uh, some notable enhancements and looks like another fantastic reintroduction of an older franchise to newer fans. I think in many ways this is exciting because I really am thinking that it's Capcom testing the waters to see if a new uh, Onimusha game would be popular. I think this is really basing those, those the sales of this version could really contribute to that series coming back in a big way. And I think that if you're going to not do an entire trilogy or include uh, the fourth game, which I never played, I forget what it was called, actually, um, this would be the logical one to bring out. Uh, so that's very exciting in that form. Uh, but what's disappointing personally is that the Switch version, which is the version I would be interested in, appears to be digital only at this time. The uh, PS4 version and Xbox One version in North America at least will be physical. I believe they said Europe that they might be digital only. And it's a little disappointing because I would be interested in this release, but I already have two copies of it on PS2, a complete copy, manual, everything, and like pristine shape, and a disc-only copy that I've had for years, got with a lot, a bunch of different stuff, and I also have the original Xbox version, so I don't really need a fourth copy of the game, despite the uh, enhancements that it has, unless it was a Switch version that would entice me with the uh, ability to have it portable and then go on the TV and just kind of... The, the freedom that the Switch version of a game like that provides, and I really enjoy playing games on the Switch since I've had the system now. So a little disappointing that I'm, I won't be picking this game up because the, that Switch version is digital only, but in general I do hope that it sells fairly well across all the different platforms. I hope it adds up to decent sales so that we could see the hopeful return of another franchise that I think has been... Uh, woefully underutilized, uh, something that was very popular and I was was one of the big Capcom series for a short period of time. Uh, it's one I've been surprised that it has not really come back before now.